So I was gonna make this video like a little music video or montage thing, but I epically failed. Well, I recorded some clips, which I'll show you as I'm showing you my like dresses and stuff. Do you know how long it takes to like change your outfit and make <laughs> whatever? Yeah, I'll just show you the stuff and if I have clips or pictures of myself wearing that dress or shirt or whatever, I'll, I'll post them like here. First is this dress. Yeah, <laughs> simple little floral print one. This actually belonged to my grandma. She passed away years ago, before I was even born, I think. Or maybe when I was a baby, I don't know. But isn't that crazy? And I kind of look like her, so when I wear it, I look a lot like her. <laughs> this is another dress. Yeah, it's just a regular strapless green dress. It's kind of like Tinkerbell green. I actually wore it for a friend of mine's quinceanera, and it was super long, actually. It went all the way down to my, like, toes, but I cut it so I could wear it regularly. Here's another strapless dress. This one's plaid. Yeah, I like plaid dresses. I like plaid anything. Here's just a regular little black dress. Um, this is another plaid type dress or flannel. I'm not sure, what is this? You've probably seen me wear it before. I used to wear it all the time. This dress is actually my sister's, but I wear it anyway because I like brown and she just left it at my house this one day so I was like fuck it that's why here's another floral print one that I have I wore it to a quinceanera once I think that was the only time maybe at a church I don't know but it's pretty I guess I really like the color here's another brown dress given to me by my sister yay black and white polka dot dress I think every girl has to own a black and white polka dot dress they serve for like any occasion, whether it's to school or to a party or anything. This is the dress I wore to prom. It's very simple, just gold and has boobage. It actually had a little thingy here. I don't know where it went. <laughs> Here's another one of those special occasion-ish dresses, I guess. It's just a short pink dress, a very bright pink dress at that. I really like it. I love bright colors. Oh my god, this dress I used to wear all the fucking time, whether it was to a party or to school or whatever. It's really simple and cute and I don't know, I just liked it a lot. This is, I don't even know whether this is a shirt or a dress, but I wear it with like tights under it. Another black dress, I don't even know where I got this one. It just kind of appeared in my closet one day and I was like, ooh, black dress, cool. I'm gonna wear it. This dress I wear all the time. I don't know why I like it so much, but I just wear it for everything. Regular shirt type top and a really nice bottom. This is actually the dress I wore to my brother's wedding like a year ago. I've worn it other times though. It's another one of those use and reuse dresses. This dress I used to wear to like every party. I think I originally bought it for a banquet. Another one of those bright colored dresses that I really love. And it's sparkly some parts. I don't know if you can tell. It's like I'm wearing Edward Cullen in leprechaun form. Here's another one of those dresses I wear all the time. I think this one used to belong to my aunt and it was also very long but I made it super short so I usually just wear it with like tights under. Another polka dot dress. It's a strapless too. I used to love strapless dresses and now I gained weight and they look kind of gross on me so I like avoid wearing them. It has a little bow. Cute. Another black strapless dress. This one used to be my sister's but now it's mine because it fits me better and it looks a lot better on me. I, I really like the print on this. It's pretty. This is another one of my I wear it all the time to school and to everything dresses. Um, it's really really short. It's just so cute. I love little dresses. I used to wear this one all the time then because it's strapless. It's another one of those twofer dresses. And last but not least, another little black dress. Another strapless little- Fuck, I have like three strapless little black dresses in there. Nerdy shirts, I guess. This one is nerdy by default because I bought it off Woot.com. I love Woot.com. I really liked it because it had a cute little owl quidditch shirt. <laughs> you guys have seen me wear this before on like daily booth and vlog TVs and stuff. Another Harry Potter shirt. I bought this one ages ago. It just has a Gryffindor thing on it. A shirt with emoticons on it. Actually, I don't know if this counts as nerdy or not. I guess it does, but I bought it at Charlotte Mood. And I guess this one counts as a nerdy shirt. It says so dark, the con of man. I only bought it because it was a dollar and because it makes references to the Da Vinci Code. And I guess I like that book or something at the time. I don't know. Anyway, um, your challenge is to reenact a scene from a movie. Try and make it funny or, you know. I can already imagine what movie you're gonna do. Am I right? Am I right? So yeah, have fun with that. And I'll see you on... 
Saturday.